All right, coming up next, it's a featherweight matchup between Daniel Hooker and Bruce Leroy, Alex Caceres. Our tale of the day for this featherweight fight. Two years apart, these two fighters, and they both possess a similar height and reach. All right, now to get us started with the introductions, here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC featherweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. A freestyle fighter holding a professional record of 13 wins, 11 losses, and one no contest. He stands 5 feet 10 inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out of Miami, Florida, Alex Bruce Leroy. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding a professional record of 16 wins, 7 losses. He stands 6 feet tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Daniel the Hangman Hooker! And when the action begins, our referee... Ready to fight? Ready. First round underway. That one hurt. There's a single attempt. If he gets the single leg takedown. So some clinch work early as they close distance. He's gonna try to take the back, I think. Brilliant job of taking the back. Caceres gets the over-under here in the clinch, Joe. Now let's see what he can do with it. He faints with the kick. A right punch followed by a left there by Caceres. Man! Right hand upstairs! Oh, nice. Well, I know he's confident in his chin, Joe, but he left his head wide open for that returning hook there. He would be wise to start moving his feet, get on the tips of his toes, and figure out a way to get that head off the center line and out of harm's way. He's doing a great job of moving and transitioning here on the ground. Trying to spin to the back. All right, hammer fist here by Hooker. Excellent movement here on the ground. Caceres gets back up again. Well, it's one thing to have length, it's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by Hooks. Big punch. Oh, he's got it going tonight. Beautiful combination of strikes there by Caceres. Man. And again, he lands another takedown there, so really scoring points here, and the takedowns are starting to pile up taking this fight exactly where he thought he could and exactly where he wants it to be. Couldn't agree with you more. Nice straight right hand. Yeah, and here he goes again. Again with the takedown. With 90 seconds to go in round one. Nice punch to the body. The ground and pound has been on point tonight. Good work here by Hooker. He's got full guard here. Good shot to the body. Oh, nice strike for him on the ground here, Joe. Hard elbow to the body. Caceres gets back up again. Look for him to try to set up another takedown here. Left kick to the body. Oh, a nice straight punch there to his opponent, and he lands it just after catching the leg. So clearly, he is starting to find his timing, not just offensively, but defensively as well. Very good read there. Look at that, oh. that jab. What an end to round one. Oh, what a way to end the round. Saved by the bell. He got stunned by a huge shot right before the horn, and now, a little bit gingerly, he makes his way back to the stool, and he's only got 60 seconds to recover here, so we'll see if his corner, physically, mentally, can keep this fighter in the fight. Let's take a look at that again. And let's look at that from another camera angle. Everything's gonna be fine, okay? Everything's gonna be fine, you okay? You okay? You look 
okay to me. You've taken way bigger shots than that. All right, that was nothing, okay? Brittany Palmer with us tonight. Definitely gonna wanna start this round off fast to try to pick up where he left off. His opponent was in big trouble at the end of that round. Certainly showing off some good hands here tonight. Oh, strong punch there by Caceres. How about that shin? Oh, nice job to block the kick. Oh, and he tags him with the straight, beautifully placed there by Caceres. Man, can we show you the total strikes? Man, Joe, he continues to leave that head open. His opponent's got to be salivating at this point in time. That jab has been there all night. You got to get that head off the center line. Nice kick there by Hooker. Oh, good right hand. gets back up, back into his comfort zone. Oh, misses with the jab. Now he goes for the single leg. And he grabs a single. Excellent movement on the ground here, always trying to better his position. Fighters back to their feet here. And busy as he looks to improve position here. Obvious redness now on the right side of his body, Joe. And they both stand up. That's a strong position for him up here against the cage. Excellent movement on the ground here. Constantly moving, constantly staying busy. Both hooks hit. From, uh, from a flattening out position when you got a guy face down, you can really hurt him with that position. Oh, that punch will count, landed flush. Excellent movement and transitions here on the ground, staying busy. Oh, that does not feel good, I wouldn't imagine, Joe. Beautiful punches here from the top eye hook. Well, his corner was pretty urgent after round one. Little bit lackluster there in that opening round. He has certainly picked up the pace here, and as a result, he has taken control of this second round. Well, the strike lands, but just not doing a whole lot of damage because his stamina oh, is low. Hit. Oh, he might be out. He's in big, big trouble here. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. Oh, big left hook there. 20 seconds to go round two. Man, another takedown. Score a lot of points with these. Now the opponent is getting up quickly, but no doubt these takedowns are starting to add up. Oh, round three next. Oh. And here's a nice shot, lands perfectly. And here's another clean shot that lands. And another perfectly placed strike. You can really see how awesome that round was by these highlights. Ariane Celeste with us tonight. Caceres, man! Switching stances here. Man, I can watch this guy all day. He continues to land. Oh! oh, he him the oh, oh he right hand. Hand. He's in big trouble. Good defense there.
Well, he's landed some excellent shots in this fight tonight, but more often than not, it has been one and done. So the emphasis now moving forward, combinations. Throw your punches and bunches, and really try to force the issue and get your opponent out of it. He's working from full mount again. Lands a punch there, Joe. Hip escape, gets out of the full mount. He's doing a great job of moving and transitioning here on the ground. He's now working from side control again. Oh, he needs the body here in side mount. Nicely played. Excellent movement here on the ground. Nice shot to the head. Excellent movement on the ground here. Always trying to better his position. Oh, nicely done there as he escapes back to his feet. Up against the cage here, Joe. Taken down by the... Holding that front headlock position. One arm guillotine here. The tight guillotine. That is a tight guillotine. He escaped the guillotine. Under two minutes to decide this one now. Hooker gets up, and somewhat surprisingly, despite having a dominant position on the ground, he wants oh! to take this fight back to the feet. Oh! This could be it! Ooh, blocks the shot. Another takedown attempt here. Oh, and he just continues to keep landing these takedowns, and it's definitely giving his opponent pause on the feet. He has gotten hesitant with his strikes and a little bit tentative because he knows he's going to be getting that shot at the legs, and more often than not, he has been taken down at will tonight. Body kick now by Hook. Oh! He's in a lot of trouble. He threw an incredibly large volume of strikes, but this last one